So what exactly happens when you use a pecan nut as thermal paste? But first though, I've dug out some 10 year old toothpaste out of my drawer and let's see what this thing smells. So we're gonna see what happens when we do this first. So as you see here, I've got my test running. I'm gonna turn on the fan real quick. Based off of that, of course, then we'll uh, have a baseline for when we try the other things. And it looks like it's averaged out around 62 degrees. Dude, so I, I, I literally went to like the farthest reaches of the drawer and there is this crusty toothpaste that has been back there for like a couple of years. This toothpaste is older than this channel probably. Yeah, this is really not the best smelling at the moment. While we get this cooler off, we're gonna have a, a conversation real quick. It appears some uh, smooth brain individuals think that this channel is serious. Uh, they've posted some memes about it. The memes are pretty fire. But yet you see one of those memes. Apparently they think I'm an idiot, which is spot on, I am. Like what else would you have to be to be doing this stupid stuff? Next up, it's time for the toothpaste moment. Uh, I swear this thing like explodes with like crusty toothpaste every five seconds. This is not gonna smell good, is it? Oh, Woo! that does not look like toothpaste. Um, okay, <laughs> this is going to smell like eight year old toothpaste and I'm going to be smelling toothpaste for the rest of this channel. Time to start it up, uh, wherever my screwdriver is. Oh. I really don't want to have to buy another motherboard just to break it. It's going to smell worse too when uh, I turn this on. Like it would be probably okay to do normal toothpaste if you had nothing else. But like, like the, the 10 year old stuff, the back of the drawer? Can we get this done with please? Like, I, I don't know how to explain this. Like, you are glad you are not here. So it looks like we're up to 64 degrees instead of 63. Let's go through and open this up now. So to summarize, you should be fine using regular toothpaste, it looks like. Uh, I just wouldn't recommend doing it with um, crusty toothpaste. I mean, I think that's the best spread we've had ever on a cooler, but like... Like, you want to talk about the worst videos I've had to do? Talk about breaking stuff on, like, on YouTube. Okay, that's pretty bad. This? This is just plain out painful. Tell you what, I'll, I'll sniff it if you subscribe, okay? I'll, I'll, I'll give it a whiff. Here we go. Uh... <coughs> I'm going to be editing this, and my room is going to smell like toothpaste. And it looks like the toothpaste is burnt. So, uh, next up on the list, it's time for some, some, uh, jelly. Now, if you've watched any of my, uh, previous videos from back, like, in 2017, uh, we did a little series where we tried some thermal pastes. That was, like, one of my first main staple series on this channel. This video is kind of, like, a homage to that, especially because we're about to get, like, 100k. You know what? I don't have anything to put it on, so we're gonna use the nut. Let's put the, the, the jelly. I mean, this don't look that bad. It doesn't smell bad either. Could be worse. Someone's gonna like, someone's gonna make another meme of this thinking that this is like supposed to be serious. Like you're supposed to do this. This whole channel's a meme. What are you talking about? And some people have been commenting like, oh, why did I change my content? I'm like, graphics card prices are so dang expensive right now. Who needs reviews of anything? Cause you can't buy anything. I had some uh, kid that I was trying to help with his computer. He was building his first computer. He literally couldn't find a graphics card. Don't buy anything right now. Watch this joke of a channel while you wait. Okay, this is a pleasant smell. Like you would think out of everything we've had today, this is a pleasant smell. And apparently my, my grandmother would like to inform you that uh, instead of a pecan nut, it's actually a walnut. She says on quote here, you should know your nuts. That's uh, in all caps, by the way. Nuts is all in all caps. 
Um, let's uh, let's try this out now real quick. So if I remember correctly, jelly or jam is extremely good at being thermal paste. It looks like I'm gonna be right though. Some things don't change in what, four years that we've done this channel. Can't believe we're gonna get four years of making these stupid videos on the channel. Well, actually, they weren't all always stupid, but they were pretty close sometimes. And I can't believe we're gonna have 100,000, apparently according to the internet, idiots that uh, are interested in this stuff too. <laughs> yeah, it's pretty much on par with thermal paste. It's really the same as thermal paste. Wow. At least this one doesn't smell smell as bad. Like there there could be there could be um worse. There is worse. There definitely is. <laughs> oh yeah, and this video is sponsored by uh, me. Yeah, I don't do sponsors, but you should play my Minecraft server. So maybe you're like me and a big fan of uh, pecan nuts. So I want to see what um what happens when you use a Okay, y'all get the point. We're gonna use this as thermal paste. Put it on the CPU for the memes because, well, yeah. Yeah. So we've got a couple options. We've got our, I'll say it, nut that we're going to put on our CPU. There's no other way to do this. And I don't think we have to worry about too much of this going everywhere. I just gotta squish it down really well. So I'm just putting our nut everywhere on here. Yeah, this is this is this is the meme video right here. I like pecan nuts a lot though. Pecan nut, like pecan pie, that's some good stuff right there. Do I need to break this up even more? Mash this down even more. Oh yeah. Okay, we've got our pecan nut in the CPU socket. Let's see what happens when we turn this on. This motherboard likes to freak me out because, uh, as I said earlier, I don't want to end up buying one. Oh, what's that temperature? Oh, we're uh, huh, uh, huh, uh, huh. We're we're really we're really up there, boys. Uh, we haven't even turned on the cook the the heater yet. Oh yeah, we're just at a a, a nice and toasty 82 degrees outside. Uh, not yeah, 82 degrees outside. What the heck is that? 82 degrees. And uh, let's see what happens when we uh, turn on the the stress test now. Um. I think we're going to hit thermal throttling like in five seconds. Oh, yeah. So the only thing that is... I got to figure out what word I want to use here. The only thing that is transferring heat from the CPU to the cooler right now is a pecan nut. Pecan nut, however you like to say it. That's the big question you have today. A pecan nut is very... um. Actually, surprisingly decent. It might be thermal throttling, though. I have a feeling it's thermal throttling. Let's see what happens when I uh, go into Task Manager real quick and see what we got there. Huh, I wonder if it's thermal throttling, guys. That's a good question. I wonder if it's thermal throttling. So what happens if you use a nut that was thermal paste? Well, um... You're going to have lots of questions. Lots of questions. Point of the story is, it looks like the CPU, uh, when you put a pecan nut in between your CPU and cooler, uh, results in, uh... 9% utilization. Cause it's definitely thermal throttling. I've never seen a CPU thermal throttle that bad. So it, it's base speed is 2.6 and it's down to 0 0.24 gigahertz. It's 2000, two, yeah, now it's gonna start speeding up as you see with when it cools down, it's gonna start speeding up again. Yeah, now it's it's still thermal throttling. What the heck? So yeah, uh, let's see how all our uh, pecan nut spread. Oh boy. Oh, yo, that's not okay. Dude, you want to talk about the most um, nasty looking thing I've seen? So we've got toothpaste, which is pretty uh, yucky. We've got a uh, pecan nut that uh, very much looks uh, very, very, very bad. Uh, so let's go through. Yeah, that just looks very bad. Like, dude, really, this looks nasty. 
Like nothing other than it just looks nasty as heck. Oh, it got on me. I mean, it does just look like chopped nut in a sense, but. So that concludes our lovely joke of a video today. I just want to let you know that we're getting close to 100,000 subscribers and I will be doing a live stream answering Q&A while I play Minecraft because I personally like Minecraft. Y'all are likely, you all are welcome to like whatever you like, but I'm a Minecraft kind of dude. So we'll be playing Minecraft while I answer Q&A. You don't have to play Minecraft, but I'll try to answer everyone's questions if you'd like. That'd be uh, probably whenever around we hit 100k, which was look at this rate is going to be like in a week. So of course, thank you very much for watching. Subscribe if you'd like to watch this idiot this idiot do more stupid stuff and as always have a absolutely wonderful day goodbye